Here we look at other features available for the hip, including lateral planning. It is possible to also plan and show the template prosthesis in the lateral hip view, although no sizing is done. All size recommendations are done in the AP view. If a normal smart hip plan has been done for the AP pelvis and it's sent to templating, the wizard can also be used for the lateral view, expanding this image. We use the hip joint ML or LM wizard. This image has been specified as an ML. Place the circular part of the wizard over the femoral head in order to center to that area and use the rectangular part of the wizard inside the canal of the femur outlining either the internal or external cortical bone in order to get the anatomical axis in position. Square handles control the end bars then send that image to templating also once in templating, the recommended size in the lateral view is shown within the canal and can be viewed for fit. Both images can be viewed at the same time and any size changes made will affect both images. In addition to the smart hip wizard already seen in AP images, we also have transitional line and hip joint AP. If we turn off the smart hip, they will naturally take the positions already identified, but these can be positioned independently. So first transitional line for measuring any leg length difference. And also hip joint AP wizard, which is also referencing from the smart hip, but can again be positioned independently. Be aware if positioning this wizard, the upper markers here in the femoral canal need to sit around the point where the canal starts to widen. The others should be parallel and to the extent of any image shown. The final wizard in this set is the femoral neck angle wizard. This doesn't measure prosthesis size and its position is being referenced off the smart hip wizard position. It measures purely the neck angle if there is an interest in this. So moving the dotted lines as guides, the femoral neck is identified and also the position and its relationship to the anatomical axis, giving a value here for the femoral neck angle. Any of these wizards will report here on the left in the planning results panel and also in the report when this is saved. This ends the tutorial on lateral hip and other wizards available in the AP hip procedure.